Hello and welcome back to the third part of the getting started with Vue.js course. In this part we are going to go over something called attribute binding. This is something we do when we want to use the value of a property inside the attribute of an HTML element. This is the code we are going to use in this part. As you can see it's the same code as in the last part but I have added a little element up here to show the image. And down here I have added one more property with the value of an image. If I save this and open it in the browser you will see that there is no image there because we have not added anything to the, val to the attribute yet. To bind this image value to the SRC up here we can add a view directive called the vbind. And inside here we type image. If you save that now and refresh, you will see that there is an image there. View also has a shorthand for this, so it can look a little bit nicer. If I just have a colon and save, it's just the same. You can also bind other types of attributes, like a link has the href tag. You can do this. And if we say colon and link, and down here I add one more property, link. A refresh, you will see that this here is linked to google.com. This kind of attribute binding is reactive, so if I update the value of link, it will automatically update inside here. So if I go to the console and type app.link equals https viewhero.com type enter and if I now click the value it will go to my website. So attribute binding is a way of using the value from the properties inside of HTML attributes. That's it for this part and I hope you enjoyed it and we will come back for the next part.